Hello, welcome back to Will's World of Reviews and more. Um, today I'm just doing a really quick video. Um, I've just um, picked up something that I thought would be interesting to show you guys. Um, I've been uh, been down to the shop because I was like, I fancy some Cocoa Pops. and uh, So I went down to Morrison's, which is only a couple of minutes away down the road. And uh, went down the cereal aisle and I had my heart set on these Cocoa Pops. and I got there and like... Um, there was an offer on the rice cocoa crackles, but you know, I, I don't know, I chose them instead, but uh, that's a different story, never mind. So as I was going down this aisle, there was um, a, like a clearance kind of shelf, you know, they always have them in supermarkets, um, hidden away kind of thing. And um, just so happened to pass by and noticed that there was these, yeah, for the grand price of 78p, reduced from £2. So um, these are Power Rangers Super Samurai minifigures. I thought, you know, even though I don't really collect other Power Rangers things other than Mighty Morphin, um, for 78p, you know, why not? Um, so basically, yeah, we should get these open and have a look. I'll just show you the packaging. Yeah, look at that. It's all right, my computer, obviously. There you go. It's not too bad. And then the back. So obviously, I think right now, we, in England, we have Mega Force out. Super Mega Force has just come out in America, maybe? I'm not sure. I'm waiting to see the Super Legends battle, obviously. Jason David Frank coming back in that, and that'd be good. So, um, these are obviously an old toy line, which is why they are 78p. So, I thought I'd just share with you guys it sounds a bit rattly, that. I'm not sure that sounds too good. Share with these guys, open them up, and, uh, and see what we've got. So, let's have a look. Oh, I feel like there's a bit of card in there or something, maybe a sticker. I'm not sure. Oh, I'll grab my scissors and we'll have a look. So, first thing, little booklet. Just gives you like pictures of all the different Power Rangers and their masks. I'll show you. Like that. Helmets, I should say, rather than masks. So, you're supposed to tick them off once you get them. Oh, there's a Gold Ranger. I don't really know much about Super Samurai. Like I say, I don't really collect much from the. Um, the new range, you know, Mike Morphin was my era, and that's why I collected it. I've got a few bits and bobs on the shelf over there that are from uh, later series, which I'll get through probably soon. Maybe. So uh, let's have a look. Ooh, and I was talking about the Gold Ranger, and look, there we've got him. We have the Gold Ranger. That is really nice, actually. Yeah. I think he stands in here. Uh, it's a really nice figure, actually. I'm surprised, you know. Obviously, they must um, kind of ha do them for all of them. Maybe they've got them out for Megaforce as well. I didn't see any in the shop. But that is a really nice little figure. Just something to kind of, you know, put on a stand or something. Obviously, there's no uh, articulation for his ability or anything. His little arms, little weapons move a little bit, like a wrist action. So, you can maybe class that. Sorry. Give you a better kind of look. Very nice detail. Very nice, actually. What's the answer to that? And the other one, I'm going to get into the God Ranger. I don't know. Probably. So that's that. And there's his little stand. And that's nice. So he goes on there, like that. And he looks very nice indeed. So yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. 78p. You know, it's alright. So, number two. Bum, bum, bum. Let's have a look. Again, we have the booklet. Same thing. I suppose you can tick them off. I can tick the Gold Ranger off now. That's that. And what were the chances? It's the Gold Ranger with the weird, not painted face. I don't really know what's going on with this. And the stand. 
So is this like some kind of special mode or something in Samurai that I'm not sure of? Maybe someone will be able to tell me. Uh, like I said, I'm really not sure. But it's nice to um, have the two, I suppose, you know. So that's really nice. So they're matching together. I do like this one better just because it's painted, obviously. So maybe I'm missing something. I'm not entirely sure. Again, just little wrist articulation, if you can call it that. But generally, still nice figure. Same mould. So, let's just have a quick look at this thing again. Because it does show you on there, as you can see, that there's two versions. So, yeah, I don't know. There's something about that, isn't there? Obviously, it's a different mode, or I'm not entirely sure. But it is pretty cool, nonetheless. So, yeah, guys, that's that's it, really. You know, um, these little figures picked up. 78p each, what are you going to do? It's made my day a little bit. You know, cheered me up. I wasn't feeling great. So, um, so that's it, really. Um, yeah, they're really cool. They're really cool. I'll put them on my shelf, and I'm, I'm sure they'll look good. So, that's it. Um, I'm hoping to come back tomorrow, um, maybe the day after. Got a bit of work to do tomorrow, but after that I'm hoping to do um, the Red Dragon Thunderzord. I decided to do them individually just because I figured I can talk about them a bit more. Um, I just hope you guys are continuing to watch these videos and liking them. Please comment, subscribe, like, whatever you want, you know, do some suggestions, watch the collection video. If you want me to do anything sooner, I will do. Um, I just want to make you guys um, happy, you know, whatever you want to do. So that's it, there you go, two little figures. 78 pH. What can you do? Peace.